In this video, you will learn about future indefinite negative simple question and negative wh question, their syntax, uses, and examples. Future indefinite negative simple question. It is an interrogative negative statement. Let's understand the rule or syntax. As per the rule one, Sentence begins with helping verb, followed by subject, word not, main verb, and question mark at the end. Base form of the main verb, helping verb shall is applicable for first person, and helping verb will is applicable for second and third person. Now look at the following sentences. First person singular, shall I not go to the office tomorrow? This sentence starts with helping verb shall, followed by subject I, pessimistic word not, main verb go, and question mark at the end. Similarly, First person plural, shall we not go to the office tomorrow? Second person singular, will you not go to the office tomorrow? Second person plural, will you not go to the office tomorrow? Third person singular, will he not go to the office tomorrow? In this sentence, Instead of pronoun he, we can mention the name of the person. Will John not go to the office tomorrow? Will she not go to the office tomorrow? Let's specify her name in place of pronoun she. Will Zara not go to the office tomorrow? Will it not go to the forest tomorrow? Assume it is a tiger. Will tiger not go to the forest tomorrow? Third person plural. Will they not go to the office tomorrow? In place of pronoun they, we can mention the names. Will John and Zara not go to the office tomorrow? In the next slide, I will explain Another way of making future indefinite negative simple question. In this slide, we will discuss rule two for future indefinite negative simple question. As per the rule two, sentence starts with contraction followed by subject, main verb, and question mark. Base form of the main verb, contraction, shan't is applicable for first person, and contraction, won't, is applicable for second and third person. Let's consider following sentences. First person, singular, shan't I go to the office tomorrow. This sentence begins with contraction, shan't, followed by subject I, main verb, go, and question mark at the end. Similarly, first person plural, shan't we go to the office tomorrow. Second person singular, won't you go to the office tomorrow? Second person plural, won't you go to the office tomorrow? Third person singular, won't he go to the office tomorrow? Let's use a noun. Won't John go to the office tomorrow? Won't she go to the office tomorrow? Specify her name. Won't Zara go to the office tomorrow? 
won't it go to the forest tomorrow assume a tiger is being referred won't tiger go to the forest tomorrow third person plural won't they go to the office tomorrow we can mention the names won't john and zara go to the office tomorrow in the next slide i will compare rule 1 and 2 with examples examples of future indefinite negative simple question rule 1 and rule 2 will you not learn a new language especially english this sentence starts with helping verb will followed by subject you pessimistic word not main verb learn and question mark at the end same message could be conveyed by using rule 2 won't you learn a new language especially english this sentence begins with contraction won't followed by subject you main verb learn and question mark at the end similarly will inflation not rise due to higher interest rate won't inflation rise due to higher interest rate will he not help you complete the assignment won't he help you complete the assignment will you not have to eat nutritious food for healthy life won't you have to eat nutritious food for healthy life will the company not release its annual report soon won't the company release its annual report soon will bus not wait for you tomorrow won't bus wait for you tomorrow will you not think you will go to the office today won't you think you will go to the office today will it not rain as per the weather forecast won't it rain as per the weather forecast is john not going to participate in the race next month isn't john going to participate in the race next month future indefinite negative wh question it is a negative interrogative statement and it starts with interrogative pronoun let's understand the rule or syntax sentence begins with question word or phrase followed by helping verb subject word not main verb and question mark base form of the main verb helping verb shall is applicable for first person and helping verb will is applicable for second and third person let's consider the following sentences first person singular why shall i not go to the office this morning this sentence starts with question word why followed by helping verb shall subject i pessimistic word not main verb go and question mark at the end similarly first person plural why shall we not go to the office this morning second person singular why will you not go to the office this morning second person plural why will you 
not go to the office this morning. Third person singular, why will he not go to the office this morning? Using the noun, we could say, why will John not go to the office this morning? Why will she not go to the office this morning? Let's specify her name. Why will Zara not go to the office this morning? Why will it not go to the forest this morning? If we are referring to a tiger, then it could be, why will tiger not go to the forest this morning? Third person plural, why will they not go to the office this morning? Mention the names. Why will John and Zara not go to the office this morning? In the next slide, I will explain another way of making future indefinite negative WH question. In this slide, I will explain rule two for future indefinite negative WH question. As per the rule two, first question word or phrase, second contraction, third subject, fourth main verb and question mark at the end. Base form of the main verb, contraction, shan't is applicable for first person and contraction, won't is applicable for second and third person. Now look at the following examples. First person singular, why shan't I go to the office this morning. This sentence starts with question word why, followed by contraction, shan't, subject I, main verb go, and question mark at the end. Similarly, first person plural, why shan't we go to the office this morning? Second person singular, why won't you go to the office this morning? Second person plural, why won't you go to the office this morning? Third person singular, why won't he go to the office this morning? Or why won't John go to the office this morning? Why won't she go to the office this morning? Or why won't Zara go to the office this morning? Why won't it go to the forest this morning? Why won't Tiger go to the forest this morning? Third person plural. Why won't they go to the office this morning? Or why won't John and Zara go to the office this morning? In the next slide, I will compare rule one and two with examples. Examples of future indefinite negative WH question. Rule one and rule two. What will you not learn this year? This sentence begins with question word what, followed by helping verb will, subject you, pessimistic word not, main verb learn, and question mark at the end. Same message could be conveyed by using rule two. What won't you learn this year? This sentence starts with question word what, followed by contraction won't, subject you, main verb learn, and question mark to end the sentence. Similarly, what will not happen due to higher interest rate? Or 
what won't happen due to higher interest rate why will he not help you complete the assignment or why won't he help you complete the assignment what will you not have to eat for healthy life or what won't you have to eat for healthy life why will the company not release its annual report or why won't the company release its annual report why will bus not wait for you tomorrow or why won't bus wait for you tomorrow why will you not think you go to the office tomorrow or why won't you think you go to the office tomorrow when will it not rain as per the weather forecast or when won't it rain as per the weather forecast why is john not going to participate in the race why isn't john not going to participate in the race thanks for watching the video subscribe to this channel like and share our videos provide your comments follow us and practice to enhance your english fluency